Welcome, Aries. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. Happy to be here with you guys. I hope you guys are safe and doing well during this time. There's a lot going on, okay? A lot going on. Just guys take the proper precautions, which is stock up on food and make sure that you're keeping your hands and your, and your face clean, okay? All right, so currently at this moment, I am running a special for the entire month of March, guys. If you want to book your very own personal reading with the Empress, all right, you can do so at a discounted rate. My readings are normally $67, okay? Right now, it's $44.44, and it is a full detailed reading as well as it comes with an additional free question. It has to be a yes or no question for your bonus question because I will be using the pendulum to answer your question, okay? So, with that being said... If you want to book your very own personal reading, that information is in the description box below. All right, if you're new, don't forget to click the bell to subscribe, okay? Now, let's hop into some things, Aries. For some reason, I'm hearing the number four. Four, four. A lot of you guys may have been seeing the number four, 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 okay? Let's see. That's two, three, and four. All right, so let's let's hop into it. I'm ready to go ahead and get into this. All right, so let's get a past, present, and future energy read for Aries. Let me see if for Aries. <laughs> All right. This is just too many cards. We're going to keep this first one, which is the higher fate in the reverse. King of Pentacles in the reverse and the Ten of Wands in the reverse. All right, a lot of you guys are going to be getting some good news that you've been possibly, you know, it took a long time for you to get this news. Like, you're happy that something is over is what I'm getting. That Ten of Wands for Future Energy in the reverse is letting me know that you have dropped something. The load, okay, has now been dropped. <laughs> and I know that sounds so weird for me to say it like that, but this is how it came out. Okay, some of you guys are closing a chapter. Yeah, we got the world and the five of swords in the reverse. It's like you've been on a battlefield, like you've been... Um, battling something here and it's finally coming to a close you're getting some type of good news you're happy about this news that's coming in we got the sun card which is leo's energy you could be dealing with the leo i got knight of, page of cups here you could be dealing with a pisces knight of pentacles capricorn's energy okay but this news you know it took a while for this news to to come out um, and I feel like you're happy about it. Like, this is finally over, okay? With the Hierophant in the reverse, you could be dealing with a Taurus. I got King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. All right, so let's see why the um, Hierophant is in the reverse. This is things being untraditional, okay? Someone does not want to make a, you know, a commitment or want to be stuck in some type of contract. I feel like... You're wanting for it movement. A lot of you guys could be dealing. Some of you guys could be dealing with the cancer. But you're ready to move forward. Okay. You're ready to progress. Something possibly has been holding you back. Something that you've been tied into. A contract or something to that nature. Has been holding you back. Something from your past. Okay. Maybe it's something that you've been hiding. Okay. Maybe you've been hiding something. Um, and been keeping something, you know, in the dark. Okay. I'm picking up as well too. For some of you guys, someone could be locked up. I got the eight of swords here in the reverse. Someone could be, you know, locked up or someone could actually be like a, a prison is like in their mind. Okay. Like someone here is very emotional and they're stuck on the emotions of the past, something from the past. That you guys are trying to move forward from. Okay. 
with the King of Pentacles here in the reverse, okay? This could be a Virgo Taurus Capricorn or someone here could possibly be feeling like a little unstable financially here. But let's see. Let's give me a clarifier for the King of Pentacles. Thank you. Okay, so you're waiting for something. You're waiting on someone is what I'm getting. We got the Queen of Cups. Oh, yeah, Five of Cups. You're feeling very regretful about something. Did someone get pregnant? Did Because I got the Empress here. Okay. With the Six of Pentacles in the reverse, this is being unable to give. I'm getting like um, a, some, someone might have had a miscarriage or someone had issues with getting pregnant. Okay. I'm getting picking that up as well. But I feel like you're waiting for something. You was like right now, you're waiting. Okay. You're waiting for some type of fight to end, okay? You want to make the right decision. You want someone to make the right decision. You're hoping that something goes, goes. Um, you know, someone is making the best decision possible. But you're fighting for this. I'm getting a lot of fight energy, like a lot of aggress aggression, Okay. Um, with this Ten of Wands in the reverse, let's see what you're releasing. Why is the Ten of Wands in the reverse here? It's like you're waiting for this to finally be over. This has been a long fight. Why is the Ten of Wands in the reverse? And don't go back, okay? Once it's done, it's done. You don't want to go back. Look at this Ten of Swords. It's over. So it's like, I'm done with this. I don't want to go back, okay? That's it. That's it. I want to move forward. Yeah. C5 of Pentacles being released from, from bondage. Something that has been keeping you. For a lot of you guys, it could be a financial situation. It could be just feeling of rejection or left out in the cold or feeling alone. Okay. For some of you guys, I'm getting like a lot of you guys are sad. Get sad sometimes. Okay. Um, when someone talks about love or talks about a certain person but i feel like you've been trying to keep things you've been trying to keep busy and keep things rolling um i feel like there's something that you're most definitely fighting for because i'm just getting like very aggressive energy but i feel like you guys are done with something a chapter is getting ready to wrap up you're waiting for this battle let's see what the five of wands is doing Maybe it's competition. Why is the five of wands here? Waiting to see who's the best is what I'm getting as well, too. I got cards that's wanting to jump out, but... Okay, page of wands. Okay, you're waiting for communication. You're waiting for someone to call. Or you're waiting for something to happen, like, out of the blue. I'm getting like a, a random text message, a random phone call um, that you're waiting on, okay? You're waiting on this. And then it's like future energy, you're dropping you're dropping a situation, okay? It's over with. You don't want to go back. You don't want to do this again. You're leaving this situation out in the cold, okay? Why is the ch chariot here? For some of you guys, there's a trip, okay? A long someone is at a distance from you. Um, it could be a Leo. Seven of Pentacles. I feel like you're losing patience. <laughs> like you're you're just very impatient in the past. You wanted things to move forward quickly. You were ready for progress, okay? But something is now currently on hold and you're waiting. Okay. You're waiting to get some news. You're waiting to hear something. And it's like something is getting dropped. Okay. Something is getting dropped. Something is going to be ending and done with. Okay. And you're not wanting to go back at, at you're not wanting to have another spin around with this at all. All right. So let's see what advice we have. For my Aries, okay? What message is there for Aries, please? What 
What message do we have for Aries? Okay. We got in the near future. Let's see. Give me another card. Peaceful resolution. Okay, so some type of resolution is getting ready to come to fruition, okay? So in the near future, be prepared because there's some type of res res resolution. For some of you guys as well, too, I'm getting recovery. You're recovering from something, okay? It could be trust issues. I'm getting that someone has trust issues here because we got trust and compromise, okay? So give me, give me one more card for Aries, please. I feel like some big changes are on the way for you. You're going to have some people helping you. Okay. You're going to get some help. Okay. You're going to, people are going to be coming in to help you. Okay. I've, I'm getting as well to some of you may be trying to maybe reconsidering a situation um, and maybe deciding on whether or not if you want to forgive this person. Okay. Some of you are going to be reconsidering. Okay, and I, I see some abundance coming in as well, too. Like, abundance doesn't always mean, like, oh, there's this big, I'm getting in this big lump sum of cash. That could most definitely be the case. But abundance just means, like, an overflow of anything. You can have an abundance of money, abundance of love, abundance of helpful people around you. Like, it's just not lacking, a, you know, a feeling of not lacking. All right. So I want to see in the near future. Why is in the near future here? Yeah. See, in the near future, every this is going to be over with. Something. See, look, and then you guys, you guys are coming out on top with the six of wands. So whatever it is that you're getting ready to dispose of is going to be in your best favor. Okay. Everybody is going to see you shine. Everybody is going to see you shine. Okay. So peaceful resolution. Why is peaceful resolution here? For some of you guys, you're dealing with the fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. But something just out of the blue, like something just happens and someone is time to take action. And once you take that action, it's just going to, everything is just going to go in your favor. Okay. Everything is just going to come together okay there may be some things that are going to get shattered down okay there may be something that's going to catch you off guard and you're going to find out that you may have to take some type of action but i feel like a resolution is getting ready to come okay so forgiveness why is forgiveness here okay someone's trying to get someone to forgive them okay yeah somebody wants to start fresh Okay, for some of you guys, this could have something to do with the mother. This could have something to do with a, it's a feminine energy, okay? A baby mother, a sister, something. Someone someone wants to start first and someone wants forgiveness, okay? And I'm also getting that someone could be pregnant here. We got Aquarius here as well, but I got the star card and the empress, okay? So someone here could most definitely be, like, find out that they're pregnant. Abundance. Why is abundance here? Queen of Cups, okay, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, okay, Seven of Pentacles, okay, so you've been waiting for a harvest, it's getting ready to come in, okay, don't, don't, don't be impatient, okay, <laughs> don't be impatient, things are going to manifest for you, okay, so reconsider, let's reconsider here, okay, Reconsider saying something, okay? Because I got the two of, two of swords in the reverse and the page of pentacles, okay? Be sure and confident what you when you when you speak your truth. Make sure that you know exactly what it is that you're saying and, and what point you're trying to get across, okay? There could be a Capricorn involved, but someone here is trying to offer something to you. Um. I feel like in the near future, someone is going to be trying to offer something to you. It could be money, okay? We got that Ace of Pentacles and Knight of Pentacles. This Knight is coming to offer you something here, okay? I feel like you don't want to have any regrets. You don't want to feel regretful. A lot of you guys are married or dealing with someone. There's a Libra here or there's a marriage. For some of you guys, there is a marriage here. Um, 
but someone doesn't want to regret something. But I feel like someone is getting ready to offer you something or you offering someone something. Um, maybe you feeling unsure about it or uncertain about it. Make sure you're doing your research, okay? Make sure you do your research before you accept any offers, okay? All right, Aries, I hope this was helpful. And until next time, my loves, ciao for now.